What's up, party people? It's your boy Voltron Supreme coming at you again with another video. It's a nice Saturday morning here and bright sunny day. So I decided, hey, let's go see what new coins are out there. And as usual, there are thousands coming out every day. Every hour there's a new coin coming out. But we gotta be careful. You know, we gotta do our due diligence before we buy that one coin. Because for every for every one good coin. There's going to be thousands, thousands of scam coins, and you don't want to get burned. So I found one that uh, caught my attention, Forest Shiba. Forest Shiba. So the first thing we do is we go check out the website. So if you find a newly minted coin and there's no website, I, I don't go any further. That's, I'm not even going to bother with that, with that coin, with that token. But this one had a website, so I said, let's go check it out. And I go there, and I'm like, Hmm. It's 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 a cute website, you know. It's it's a cute website, but it's a simple website. And okay, so this means I have to look a little deeper, because you know I go, do they have anything on developers? Nada. Okay, so that's that's a flag for me already when when I don't know um, if there's anything on the developers. So there's no mention about the developers. Then I go, hey, let's see if they have a Twitter. They don't have a Twitter account. What's up with that? No Twitter account. That's kind of another flag for me. So I'm like, hmm, do they have Telegram? They do, they do have a Telegram. And this coin is gonna be launched in a couple of hours. And there were people that were on the Telegram, but the admins have decided to not let anyone else comment. So that's a flag for me. When admins start to do that, that's a flag for me because there are gonna be people that do their research and they may have questions that the admin doesn't want asked. So, okay, so we, we got a couple of flags here, but we still gotta, we gotta look a little deeper, you know? So let's analyze the, the, the contract. When, we, when, when you analyze the contract, one thing jumped out at me. There's no liquidity. So there's no liquidity. So this, this already is scaring me. No liquidity. So this could potentially be a rug pull. So now, now I'm, I'm, starting to, I'm starting to get scared here. So <clears throat> I'm, not, I'm, not, I'm not liking what I'm seeing. You know, so I said, let's, let's look at the contract a little deeper. It's a similar to a previously released coin. Yes. Yes. So it's basically an exact copy of a previous coin that was known to be a rug pull. They just changed the name around and have re-released it under a new name. So I don't think this coin's gonna get my Starbucks money. I'm not saying that it's a scam. It's up to you to do your own research. But this is one where I would be careful because they may, as, the, as, the, as it's time to release the coin, put a little bit of liquidity in there and then um, remove it. You know, still do a, do a rug pull because it looks like in the old contract, under the old contract, under a different name, that's kind of what they did. They just pulled the liquidity out. So it wasn't locked. So you guys be careful, safe investments, and remember, do your own due diligence. I'm not saying this coin's a scam. I'm just saying it's not getting my Starbucks money. So until later, guys, peace out.